Vicky, that was an important win today, 3 0 against University of Stirling. Some of that game. Um, I think it's quite hard to sum it up other than like a real gritty performance. And uh, we've got nice football players in there who let themselves down last week, so I think we had to use that and try and turn that into a bit of a positive. And they certainly never let themselves down today. And that's that, that's the whole squad. We had, you know, more or less five players struggling before the game. Um, at one point, it, it looked like we might have had two players on the bench. Um, but in fairness, the guys who had knocks and won 100 percent managed it well and they showed a really really good attitude um, a bit of character as well to go out there and, and do what they needed to do and, and they got the result they deserved Stirling Union are a very good side very good side they've been together for a while I mentioned that before um, so it's hard to play against and they're a good they're a very good team as well you know they're, they're played together they're a very good coach and Chris and I don't mean that in any patronising way um, other than I think there's sometimes a perception of the university teams um, not being, you know, uh, as good a team that, that Stirling actually are. They are they're very hard to get play against. That, I think that's my first win against them, actually. And I said to the boys, I remember going back to the League Cup last year, um, and we got beat 4-1 on that day. It's probably the lowest, one of the lowest I've been as a coach, because I saw my team, they were miles off it, they didn't want it, and I took that game particularly hard. Um, and I knew at that point I had to change things going into this season. So they've got a fantastic group of boys in there, a group that well deserved their win today um, with their work ethic and their spirit in there. And it's important now that we build consistency. I think we've got consistency. We've had a couple of kind of strange results, poor performance against Kelty. I know the reasons for that one. Last week wasn't good enough. Uh, and the guys know that and it hurt them. Um, and they played with a lot more pride today. And now we've got to kick on to Bonnie, uh, Bonnie Rigg next week. And they're right top of the league, flying at the moment. It's a bit of a test for us, but good to come off. Aye, they're a good side. Um, they've got good experience, but I think there's areas of weakness there. And we're going to work really hard with the guys this year, uh, this this week rather, um, to go and exploit those weaknesses. Um, and I think if we can go and play our own game, we change the style a little bit today. Um, we've started to go a wee bit more direct and that's not a style of play thing. We still encourage the boys to pass the ball. Um, but I felt there was space in behind them and we had pace and energy up front to go and do that, uh, to go and exploit that. Um, so, like I say, I've got a plan in my head that we're going to go against them. Um, it's up to the guys to buy into it and then go and deliver it next Saturday.